What is going on guys, my name is CBK and welcome back to another Sims for 33 day create a sim challenge video. Today we are moving on to day 7 and day 8, meaning that we are going to be creating first a hybrid sim and second a female child, uh, but we're not allowed to use the play with genetics button, it's got to be an authentically created masterpiece. So one thing I had to do before I started this was actually google what on earth a hybrid sim was. Uh, and it turns out there is a sim that is half human, half alien. That is what that is. Um, so we have to have an alien man or an alien woman, and they have to have a child with an alien, a human man or a human woman. Of course, it makes sense. So we're going to go ahead, do this a little bit like the random genetics challenge. We're just going to randomize these things. Uh, and then we're going to do three randoms on this entire character. Here we go. Right, so there we go. We have the mother, Janine Cassius, <clears throat> and uh, the alien is going to be called Caleb Wheeler. Okay, now we're going to randomize this alien three times. Are they ever not in the outfit? What on earth? Okay, we have this fruity guy with some uh, orange earrings. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> So these are our two sims, our female and our man there, and we are going to go ahead and add a new sim now. And it's going to be the child of these two. Let's see what we get. Holy moly. There we go. We have a random daughter now. Now we are going to, uh, now we're actually going to go to work on making this lovely young lady whose name is Mercedes. Jesus, Mercedes Casillas. What, what a name. Uh, we are going to go ahead and customize her a little and uh, make her look like an everyday human. I think that hair can work, okay, because it kind of looks like her mom's hair, but not too much. It's flicked a different way. I think that could be cool. I mean, we need to get out of this, like, space suit. I don't know why it was only giving us full body things, but it, it was. It just kept giving us full body over and over again, and I'm not sure why it was doing that. But let's see if we can find something that she would like to wear. Is she a fan of unicorns? Is she a fan of robots? <sighs> Do aliens like robots? I don't know. Is she a cat fan? I'm not entirely sure. She can be whatever we choose her to be because that's the way this game works. I really want to put her in the really adorable cat jumper. Oh, I like this. This is funny. So we could give her this, which makes it look... It's a little alien shirt. And it's funny because she's... You know, she's a little she's a little alien, guys. Just in case you didn't clock that. Oh, maybe we could give her some like really cool like shades or glasses or something. I feel like she could rock some shades. Oh, yeah. Check her out. She's already way cooler than me, and she's a child. That's upsetting, isn't it? Have a little strawberry necklace as well. Why not? Don't think we need to give her any alien makeup. That looks ridiculous. No, after toying with the makeup options, we definitely don't need that. That's that's silly. Uh, let's go back down here. Okay, let's get her some uh, trousers. What are we working with here? We've got to remember she's just a kid. I don't want to dress her too adult. Those are some of the most horrific things I've ever seen in my life. What? What is this? <laughs> See, she can't wear green because it clashes with her skin. Is it? Is it cruel to put your child in full orange? I'm trying to work out if it's cruel to put my child in full orange outfit because, like, I kind of like how that looks. Oh, my God, we could give her dinosaur feet. <gasps> oh, my God, she's just a cute little alien with dinosaur... No, no, we shouldn't. We shouldn't. I'm getting sidetracked. Can she have space boots on? The, those are hideous. No, let's not do that. These all seem like very adult shoes. Those are cute. Not available in orange, though. Hmm. Maybe we literally could just let her wear sports shoes. Like red and white. I like that. See, I think that looks cool. Do you guys not think that looks cool? I think Mercedes Casillas is an absolute baller right now. Let's see if we can give her some little bracelets. I love that I can give her odd socks. That's incredible. Yes. I endorse the odd socks. And now she has one orange one to go with the theme of this uh, character that we built here. Would she look wild with that color hair? No, okay, she needs, to, she needs to keep the dark hair. As a representative of her mother, she must keep the dark hair. Okay, you know what? I think that she is as good as done. Now, what's funny is that I didn't really think about what I was doing. And when I was making a hybrid sim, I actually made a hybrid child. The next challenge was supposed to be female child, but I just did that. Um, so maybe we skip female child and we go straight to make a sim that looks like a model. That's the next one. I'm going to skip that. I am sorry. I didn't really think about what I was doing, to be honest. Um, but here we are. We're going to move on to creating a sim that looks like a model. Well, look at that job done. This is the random one we spawned in. There's a model. 
He looks like Aslan the lion. His name is, of course, Darian Doe. Darian Doe. So let's create someone that looks like what I would consider a male model. Okay, here we go. Let's see what we're working with here. Uh, you know, we'll randomize face and skin tone. There we go. And we'll work with that now. So, male model. Let's go with, you know, full, full masculinity. Moderately slim, but not too slim. Bring your stomach in. Again, this is another one of those things like the ugly to beauty challenge here, guys. This is completely, you know, this is just what I'm thinking. If someone says to me, think of a male model, I just think of some ripped, ripped dude with great hair. Um, this guy does have great hair. I'm not sure how I feel about the beard. Let's drop the beard for now. Can we drop the beard for now? Is there a no beard? Oh, there is. Okay. See, I think I prefer him without the beard. But I want longer locks. Long hair. Okay, I think we got pretty lucky with the face shape and stuff. Like, he, he's a pretty good looking dude. Okay, not that long. Some of these, I would, these aren't even long. Oh, now I've got rid of his hair. Okay, going to all hairs. Ah, there's what I was looking for. <laughs> Man, he can almost pull off a girl's haircut. Like, that's impressive. This guy is good looking. That's how you know. That's like the rules. If he can pull off another gender's haircut, he's Gucci. No, I think we maybe did have the best hair for him already. We'll give it the blonde treatment. I can, okay, you know what? I think he looks, I think he's looking good. Let's, um, I don't even want to change his face. I'm not even going to change his face. I think he looks good. Okay. Now to move on. I mean, male model, what would you wear? Something super tight, right? Like something that really shows, hey, I am muscular. Look at me. My Patronus is a fat chocobo. I don't think that's quite going to cut it for this guy. Not really what we're going in for here. Maybe we'll just throw him in a tank top. Like, we could just literally chuck him in a tank top. That's a very jazzy tank top. I don't think I want that. Okay, I'm digging the red and black. I don't know what the heck this is. I have no idea what, like, if this is a team or something. What's it in? It, oh, it's actually from a real expansion pack. Well, now I'm really not sure. We've got to find something that fits with the uh, short, the top that he's got going on. I don't think Hawaiian shorts are going to cut it. As much as I love those, those are beautiful. I think he does need some shorts, but I'm not sure what kind. Not jean shorts. That's no good. No, not that. No, stop it. It depends. Is he actually playing the game or is he just a fan? If he's just a fan, he can get away with like basically whatever he wants bottom half, right? Because I, I wear like tank tops of things all the time that I'm not going to play a game. Maybe we can get away with these. Not white. No, 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 no. Maybe put him in some black shorts. Okay. I think he's, I think he's looking pretty good. The only other option I can think of for this is, is there a button-up shirt that is unbuttoned? Because that would be incredible. Ah, it doesn't like that is. Let me have a quick scroll through, see if I can find an unbuttoned t-shirt. Now, the only other thing I could find while scrolling through here that they would probably wear is something, again, that shows off muscles. So we'd be looking at something like a v-neck top. So yeah, that's pretty, you know, a lot of guys wear those so they can show off their pecs. Now, I don't like it. I prefer, the, I prefer what we had previously. Let's undo that. Let's keep him like this. I think he's, you know what? I think he's looking good. I don't think there's really anything wrong with him. Oh, the shoes. That's what's wrong. What are those? Come on, man. I think he needs something a little sportier just based on what we've got going on here for the rest of the look. There you go. Let's give him some nice running shoes in black and gray. I think, I think that looks fine. Unless we can find something that's... Oh, those go super well with the rest of the outfit. We've got red top with black, black bottom, and then red, black shoes. I think that that's going to work absolutely perfectly. I don't think I can make him look much better. Okay, let's go ahead and do his formal wear. I know we don't tend to do formal wear for these things. My God, he already looks sick. What, what on earth? I wasn't expecting to instantly look that good. Uh, oh yeah, get yourself in a cyborg suit, bro. There you go, you look dope. Gotta try and find something that suits him. You know, his massive upper body, but not really anything else. Oh yeah, yeah, he's rocking the gray. I like it, I like the gray. I think we keep him in the gray with the brown shoes as well. You know what, for my own curiosity like legit curiosity i want to mix him with i want to i want to add an alien now um an alien female okay alien female let's randomize her a couple times oh yeah there we go we got ourselves a hot alien mama i kind of want to see what these two guys churn out if they have a child honestly because they're good looking people see that's an interesting one like, what if we got a sibling okay so we literally got the mother again like the exact same what look at that that guy and that girl make this girl. Is there any difference there? Look at that. I love their daytime disguises. My goodness. Well, guys, that is going to be it for this episode of the 33 Day Creator Sim Challenge. Hopefully, you did enjoy this video. If you did and you want to see the rest of the days of the challenge, because you've still got a lot left, 
Let me know by leaving a like and subscribing if you're new. Drop a comment on the video, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.